Welcome to From Fat to Fit, where our motivation is to inspire you to get up, get moving, and create a healthier you for a brighter tomorrow. Let's get started. All right, guys, I wanted to give you my post-workout message. You see this sweat? This video is going to look a little bit easier because it is all hit. There's no lifting to this. So it is a 60-minute hit, then 45, then 30, then 15. We're doing three sets of that. Then you're going to do two 30-second burnouts of all four of those moves. It's tough, but you can do this. I believe in you. If you can't do the moves exactly the way that I do them, then modify them. Modify them in a way that's safe for you, but effective. I trust in you. I believe in you. I know you can do this. The Lord will give you the strength that you need to get this done. Enjoy the video. All right, guys, this is my favorite time of the week. It's legs day. Today, we are going to be doing some high intensity interval training. So high knee runs, triple bear, plank squats, alternate reverse lunges. So with these workouts, what you really want to focus on is continuing to move, continuing to get your heart rate up. It doesn't matter if you can do the move fully, it doesn't matter if you can do the move fast, if you have to slow it down, just keep moving. These moves can be a little tricky. The high knee run's not too bad. You can modify that. It's just bringing your knees up. The triple bear is a little bit harder, a little bit more of a um, advanced move. So if you can't do the triple bear, just getting down in this plank spot and lifting your knees off the ground a little bit for a little bit of time, you don't have to take the jump. So if you just lift your knees up for a little bit, lift them back down, lift them back up for a little bit, you are still gonna feel that burn in your quads. The next move after this is the plank squat. If you can't get down into the plank position, just go into a squat and come back up. You're still moving, you're still increasing your heart rate. Then the move after that is alternate reverse lunges. Now, if you need to modify this lunge even further than what I will do, you can always grab a hold of a chair or you know a couch or whatever you have near you to help lower yourself to the ground. That way you're still working and still moving those muscles. All right guys, onto the burnout round. So just keep moving for these two sets. Keep going, I know you can do it. I just wanna be an encouragement through this all. So as I'm working through this, I just want to talk about nutrition for just a minute. Remember, you cannot overcome a bad diet. You cannot work to lose weight when you are eating terrible. So really start taking small steps to improve what you're eating, improve your diet, and really start focusing on that just as much as you are working out. Right, guys time for core get ready we're gonna flatten this abdomen let's go so we're gonna start off with bent windshield wipers and then go into a reverse crunch keeping your back flat on the floor moving your knees side to side with the reverse crunch you're doing just that you are doing a reverse crunch so instead of bringing your chest up you are bringing your legs to your chest All right, guys, that wraps up legs day. As always, stretch it out. Great job. Keep it up. Make sure you leave a like and God bless.